welcome to my channel. So today, decided to do something a little, little different. Uh, so back when I was a little peewee golfer, I had a little junior top, top flight golf set. And uh, honestly, those have been probably sitting in my garage for like two or three, actually no, longer than that. Four or five years, actually, could be like eight years. But uh, so I decided let's go, uh, let's do a little challenge today. So today I'm actually headed to a little par three course, not too far away from me. And I'm gonna actually try to see if I can shoot under par with a junior golf set. This is gonna be, it's gonna be very interesting given that they're like probably a good six, eight inches too short for me and they probably get the, the flex of a hula hoop. They, uh, they aren't gonna wanna stay stiff with me. So I might end up slicing a lot of them. It's gonna be interesting, but uh, I'm excited. Do something a little different, maybe get get some new viewers who actually like watching some challenge videos. I haven't done too much upon that, so but but yeah, let's get into it. Because right now in a junior set, the junior set I had when I was a kid, I actually only have a seven iron, a nine iron, and a putter. But I also I had a driver, but I'm playing a part three course. I'm not gonna need a driver. But uh honestly. Depending on how far I can hit the, the seven iron, I might I might need the driver. But tough thing is I didn't bring it, so <gasps> this is gonna be it's gonna be fun. But yeah, I'll see you there. A few moments later. What can I get for you? Hey, can I just get a small ice caramel swirl with almond milk, please? And then I'll take a, a glazed donut, please. And that'll be it. All set. Thanks. Yeah, we had to make a little pit stop. Need a little bit of coffee and a little, little sugar in me. All right, a little taste test. Oh fire dunks can be a little inconsistent so i usually go with the uh the old caramel swirled almond milk and don't get the granulated sugar just because if they put too much granulated sugar it literally ruins the coffee it's just sitting at the bottom and i'm drinking friggin granulated sugar for friggin my coffee but uh yeah honestly they they did well today they did well and you know you always gotta get a glaze with it. That's a, that's a guarantee. By the way, this video ain't sponsored by Dunkin's, but hit me up, Dunks. We got a great sponsorship coming. Here we are. Met the links in, uh, I think it's East Hampstead. I'm not too, too sure. In New Hampshire. Fairly nice golf course, honestly. They, they maintained it really well. It's been redone recently. But yeah, here we go. These are the clubs I'm going to be using. These little junior top flight clubs. It's going to be interesting. A little challenge video. Just to give a. Uh, yeah, they're barely up to my waist. But yeah, let's go. Not bad for a little junior nine iron, I'll tell you that. Bring a little rock flight club. Like I said before, this is this used to be, I think, Brookstone. It got bought out by another another company. And uh honestly, it looks extremely green out here. It's looking really nice. Like this is beautiful. I'm liking the sand too. Not raked, but uh yeah, that really doesn't have to do with them. But uh yeah, let's go walk over my ball.
All right, first hole not great. One over, I'm gonna have to make that up with a birdie, but let's keep going strong. Beautiful day out, the sun's actually starting to peek out a little bit. Loving it. It's a loose crane. Someone come get their mans. He's a little camera shy. I'm gonna have to stop pointing the camera at him. Still zero greens hitting regulation. And a little bit right, because I've been hooking it. Hooking it left since this club is so freaking, look at this thing, it's insane, but uh, so close, so close to getting on a regulation, but I guess there's always next hole. So, this is going to be a bit interesting. We got a 170 yard par three. And uh, we're all the way back here. So, it's going to be tough. I'm going to have to freaking put my put my everything into this shot. Tee it nice and low and just freaking. Right now, we're actually one over. So, I just birdied the last hole. I'm so happy about that. I literally had like a good like, what, 15 footer. Nailed it with a freaking. I don't even know. A rookie putter, if you want to call it. A junior putter. Oh, man. That, that got me nice. I'm feeling good. One over. Let's see if we can make that to Zippo. So after that hole, with a five, after dubbing it off the tee like an absolute moron, put myself a three over. We're through six right now, so I mean, I have some time, but it's not looking good. I was I was hanging in there, but now, now I'm coming back. I gotta work my way back into this.
So we got about a 170 yard par three. There is absolutely no chance I reach, get even close with that seven iron, that junior seven iron. So I think I'm just gonna take a loss on the day and try to put it close with my, my old six iron. So let's do. Well, I'm actually pissed off because you just missed, missed my insane Sally. Your boy just took a six iron and probably put it within five feet of the hole. Good 170 yard par three. So uh, I'll do a little recreation of the Sally for you. All right, well, we ended up playing nine holes of that par three and ended up shooting probably six over. So not even close to even, not even close. So if you take anything away from this video, go buy some real clubs. Do not bring junior clubs if you're an average size guy to go play par three because just totally throws you off. You're slicing it. You go to chip. The club face is probably the size of the ball itself. It's it's nuts. I don't know how they give those kids those to kids and they do well. No idea. But uh, thanks for thank you guys for watching. If you uh, if you like this content, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to my channel. Leave in the comments if you like it because if I see that people like it, I'll make some more of these. I enjoy doing some challenge videos, getting out here, playing some golf, just out here to have some fun. And when you're making a competition out of it, it takes all the fun out of it. So doing stuff like this. Makes it a lot of fun. And uh, I'm glad I, go, I put some smiles on people's faces as they drove by seeing me playing golf with some junior clubs that were way too small for me. They just pull, they, they drive by and they just look and they'd start laughing. And I'd be like, yeah, that's me. I'm looking like a tool in the golf course. But we had some fun. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.